there's a few ways to test for natural amber. One of the easiest ways is to simply use a bowl of water. And you'll notice that some imitation plastic beads will sink to the bottom of the bowl of water. Then you'll also notice that natural amber teething necklace will also sink to the bottom of the water. Now if we're to take this water in this bowl and pour a whole bunch of salt in it and uh, wait a few moments until the salt starts to dissolve and give it a bit of encouragement to do that, we can then notice something interesting. The imitation plastic beads will still sink to the bottom, but when we take the amber teething necklace and put it in this salty solution, we'll notice that it actually floats to the top. This is because the specific gravity of the amber beads is very slightly less than the salt water solution, but more than the water itself. Also, if we have access to an ultraviolet light source, we'll notice that natural amber behaves in a certain way under ultraviolet light. So it can be another handy little test um, if you have an ultraviolet light source that you can use to test your amber teething necklaces. If you're in doubt that your amber beads are actually real. Thank you.